According to North Korea state media, the second most powerful military official after leader Kim Jong Un named Park Jong Chon has been sacked. Park was the vice chairman of the Central Military Commission of the ruling Workers' Party and the secretary of the party's Central Committee. As per the official KCNA news agency, he was replaced by Ri Yong-gil at the committee's annual meeting last week. No reason for the termination of the military official was reported. As per reports, Pyongyang regularly reorganizes its leadership and the year-end party gathering has often been used to announce personal reshuffles and major policy decisions. State television showed Park sitting in the front row of the podium with his head down during the meeting while other members raised their hands to vote on personal issues. His seat was later showed unoccupied. He was also absent in pictures released on Monday by the official KCNA news agency of Kim's New Year's Day visit to the Kum Susan Palace of the Sun, which houses the bodies of his grandfather and father, unlike in October when Park accompanied Kim on a trip to the palace to mark a party anniversary. The party's Central Military Commission, which is headed by Kim, is considered the country's most powerful military decision-making body above the Defence Ministry. Park's replacement came as Kim called for developing new intercontinental ballistic missiles and a larger nuclear arsenal to counter the United States and South Korea as key to the isolated country's 2023 defence strategy. Park had rapidly moved up the military ladder from a one-star artillery commander in 2015 to a four-star general in 2020, taking credit for contributing to progress in the country's short-range missile technology. In late 2020, Park was promoted to the Politburo and earned the title of Marshal, the highest military rank under Kim, and became a leading voice last November against joint South Korea-US military exercises. Park was briefly demoted in mid-2021 after Kim reprimanded some officials for their handling of North Korea's anti-coronavirus policy before being promoted again months later. Park's dismissal comes despite Kim mostly appreciating the country's advances in weapons development during the meeting, unlike other areas where he pointed out some faults and called for improvement. Park's successor, Ri, is also a senior military commander who held key positions including Chief of the Army's General Staff and Defence Minister. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.